Well, the latest data released by the World Health Organization suggests that the real COVID death figures might be three times the reported numbers. Till now, the official data has reported that over 7 million fatalities uh, from the beginning of the pandemic until the end of 2023 were reported. And now, the WHO has said that the actual death toll from the disease may have been closer to 21 million. And while the coronavirus may no longer be of concern to most people, there are those who continue to suffer silently from long-term impacts of COVID. The WHO is currently in the process of conducting an analysis of the excess deaths during the pandemic as well as after the disease ceased to be a global health emergency. What is excess death that the health body is probing? Well, it is calculating, uh, calculated based on the difference between observed deaths in a specific time frame and the expected number of deaths from the same period. Here is the data from the WHO that it is presenting. The figures compare COVID-19 excess mortality estimates and reported deaths by WHO Region 2020. At the regional level, COVID-19 excess mortality estimates range from uh, 1.34 to 1.46 million in the region of uh, Americas to 1.1 to 1.21 million in the European region and uh, the figures of course on your screens of other such uh, areas as well where there has been a spike. Now researchers say that this unusual a discovery is due to some countries not reporting the death toll correct correctly. The actual number of infections caused by the virus is also subject to speculation. Under reporting cases of COVID-19 deaths from, um, from the government records and amid a spurt in infections worldwide, this could be a concern, particularly in terms of capturing important data that would help the health authorities make the right call in case a need arose again.